What's up guys, another video, real fast. So, I got to think about something, and uh, something not really many people have thought about. I have not seen any other videos online for it. So, I put a little bit of thought into the past few days and stuff, and I decided to make a video about it now. So, uh, scopes or optics for an SHTF situation, like which one would I prefer? Well, a lot of that's gonna have to go ahead and be a matter of what am I doing? Am I hunting, am I fighting? Am I just using it for defensive purposes or what? But I think for the most part, I would definitely have to say a scoped rifle. So this right here is my one of my ARs. It's got a uh, an FM optic on it. It's like a uh, what is it a three by six or a two by six scope on it. I mean this thing's zeroed for 100 yards. It's actually one of my deer rifles I use. And I also hunt coyotes with it. A pretty good gun. Pretty reliable and pretty accurate and I like it and one thing I must say I do like about it is for an SHTF situation you're not gonna have a whole lot of ammo well most likely won't and all that so you're gonna want to be able to keep your gun zero for the most part and you also want to use a rifle for more than just shooting so if you use a scope you can use it to magnify it to uh, look and identify things if you don't have binoculars or such like that alright so now I've got a uh, ACOG over here on this rifle and all that and uh, so this part of the right here it, it gets light on it and then it'll perform like a dot and a reticle inside of the uh, the lens and all that I'll see if I can let it come up yeah you can see the little green dot right there so that is one thing I do like about that rifle it's got that and all that so as long as you're in sunlight and all that you do have uh, you got your dot and stuff. So then I go over here now, and I got this uh, right here is an Anderson rifle. It's one of my it's one of my more favorite rifles. I like to shoot a lot. It's got a reflex sight on it. This thing here is a little cheap one and all that. It's battery and all that. So I can just turn it on, and then put it up. And you see, I got another dot right there. All right. So we go ahead and turn this back off now. All right, so yeah, I got that, and then and then I've also here on a Sig and PXK, I've got an EOTech, and if you're not really familiar with an EOTech, it's a holographic sight and all that. So I'm not really gonna go and show that one either, though. But yeah, so what would I choose? Would I choose a scoped rifle or an optic or possibly open sights? Notice none of my guns have open sights. Um, yeah, I probably need to put them on a gun or something like that, but I actually just have not got around to it. But I have to say, I would choose a scoped rifle before I would choose an optic rifle or anything like that. The reason being is you can use them to magnify, to look at targets and such, to use it to look at things. And then another thing is, it doesn't take batteries. Because eventually your batteries are going to go dead. And all, especially if the grid is down or anything like that. So when the batteries go dead, unless you have a whole bunch of batteries, you're, you're not going to be able to like use your optic at that point. It's just going to be on there and it's going to be worthless. So, that is something to think about for a lot of people because no one seems to really think about that. And I don't know how many times I've left my optic on when shooting and then put it away and forgot all about it. And I went to use it later and it was dead. So that is definitely something people need to think about more often. So, a scope or a uh, an optic. Definitely would say a scope. It's got more use for it and you can use it to find longer range targets and all that. But yeah, that is just something I wanted to touch on because I've seen nobody else on the internet has made a video for it or anything like that. So yeah, if you have any thoughts or on it or maybe concerns about the video or anything you want to add to it, go ahead and leave a comment down below. I, uh, I tend to get with all the comments and review them and stuff. So uh, yeah, if you like the video and you want to see some more gangster shit like this, let me know. If you just like the video, leave a comment, mm -hmm. then be sure to subscribe to the channel. That helps me get an idea of like what I need to post more of and all that kind of stuff. So uh, yeah, guys, until next time, uh, toodles.